What's up, y'all? So was was the mod prank real reaction? Stop the cap. Hashtag stop the cap. Uh, we about to get into this video. You dig? Ma, I got a lot to say this bag season. All right, and let's <laughs> let's see what happened. You dig? Let's get into it. Hurry up. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Nick G, the host, and today I'm back with another reaction video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. You dig what I'm saying and what the goddamn hell you league. So, um, I already read the title. Let's get into it. Two, what's good? It's your boy, M.O.D. And, uh, I guess you're gonna know what reaction this is. Let's get to it. Uh, I don't, I don't got, I don't really have all day for this. Let's get to it. Oh. Oh. What's up, y'all? Oh, is it dark? Uh, so, <laughs> as y'all can tell by the title, it'd be him drinking wine I for me. I'm <laughs> going to be addressing some things. <laughs> you too. Oh, God. What's up, y'all? Oh, is it dark? Uh, so, is that wine or tamana? <laughs> as y'all can tell by the it title, it looks like wine. I am going to be addressing some things that. Mod said in his video about me. First of all, I got me some sour patches. All right, let's get got... to the meat. Let's talk about. Where we get into it? Uh, I was going back and forth with myself, and I was asking myself. I was, you know, trying to before I actually do stuff or do anything. I like to. You know, think twice about it or actually like analyze, like make sure that I'm doing it for a good reason. And just basically, um, I didn't want to make it seem like I'm doing this for clout. I didn't want y'all to think that. And, and everything is for clout. Okay. <laughs> honestly, I'm doing this video because I just feel like it'd be good for content. She. He did a whole video, a 45 minute video. Clearly it's like important or he had a lot to say when he could have, you know. I Again, I only spoke because. Because she addressed it first. She called him out first. <laughs> I'm not going to lie to y'all. In the situation with Minx, Ma just disappointed me a lot. <laughs> However, in this situation, he's just, he's not wrong at all to me. I am completely on his side, one hundred percent, in this video. <laughs> My name was brought up. Well, in this times si situation, when I was stressed out. I'm still stressed out. You feel me? Nobody knows. I still feel. I'm like fighting a whole. I'm fighting a whole case with Jordan right phone now. Call when I call like two, three times. Not stressed. More than one time before he. Huh? Okay. <laughs> made the video. <laughs> Again. For <But> murder. <laughs> when we did a video in the past. She said she went ghost on people before for her own reason. Before I even said anything about him not re you know, responding to me, I just feel like, I feel like if he felt like whatever he felt like in the video, I watched the whole video and it's some stuff that I want to like address and just kind of like get my perspective on um, as well. So I'm going to say that, but I did feel like instead of him doing that video, he should have just answered the fucking phone. I feel like he didn't have to answer the phone. I feel like he paid his own phone bill, and I feel like if she ain't putting in on it, he don't have to answer her ass. Simple and plain. Would it have, would it have been convenient for her? Sure. But is that what he did? No. So why are we still talking about this? Like, I'm the type of person, like... I don't owe anybody anything to answer the phone he don't. except for my mother my father my brother and my close friends that's, that's how i feel if i'm going through something i don't feel like i disagree with that point you know i disagree with that point i, I said too. maybe i could have handled it differently it could have just he you said know, that maybe one text but then i did respond to the text and that wasn't good enough but like i'm straightforward like if i got something to say i'm gonna i'm gonna say it to you like i'm not gonna take it to the end like i'm not even like it that's not even my character that's a lie because she the one who brought it to the internet so 
Yeah. <laughs> Again, I disagree simply because when you weren't getting responded to, you went on Instagram Live and spoke to the fan base about And even when I mentioned it before, like when I was telling y'all on my live, and even when I mentioned it in the video, I only did that because y'all were on my ass. I'm pretty sure y'all was on his ass too about why, why we wasn't doing videos and stuff like that. How can we go from making videos back to back to not making none? You know what I'm saying? So it was... Very simply, by just not doing any videos together. I agree 100%. <laughs> I don't I, like of course the f the fan base that you now have you know and you're prospering with was created from us both being together so they're gonna ask that question it's your choice to not respond answer to it or not but just, I got she chose violence <laughs> I get why people was asking us or asking me um, where we was like, what happened to us or whatever. So I just simply said, what happened? I didn't bash him. I didn't try to make him look bad. And if I did, I apologize for that. But that wasn't my intention. Maybe I should just keep my mouth closed. I don't know. There are no tips to streaming. There are no tips to YouTube. There are no tips to doing any of this shit except just do it. Y'all, when I first started YouTube, well, this had nothing to do with the video. I'm responding to somebody. When I first started YouTube, I was getting five viewers, eight viewers, 20 viewers, and I was happy with that. That's the difference. So you got to be happy with the people that's supporting you and keep grinding. Do uh, um, viral shit, anything viral. People think I'm a queen sucker and a Clarence sucker. Nah, that's just what my following like to see. It brings me views. So if you want people to tune in, just like my God is doing this because she's calling him out. This is some shit he probably don't want to do, but it's going to get him views. So he got to do it. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. That's all I got. <laughs> things, could have been, things can go different ways. You know, you just never know what. But I did what I feel like was right at the time. And yeah, so. Now, the only the only the, the only thing is like if she went live all the time it would be like it would be like more of a like yo maybe I, maybe i was tripping you feel me <clears throat> but like when you only go to live to speak about a certain subject mm -mm. no it's not havoc those aren't my videos honestly i can't do it <laughs> you you see how much i gave them that's all i got because it's it's not tips to this, you know? People want you to give them, like, information that isn't there. And the only information that is given is to stay consistent. React to shit. That's all I got. <laughs> and especially viral shit. Get into anything that's viral. I, I can't give you an eight-minute video on that. I, I, I can't do it. So I got a few things. I wrote a few things down. And I don't like a few things, literally, because I don't want to make this video long. I was going to react to his video, but it's not a reaction channel. I mean, maybe it would have been a good idea, but I don't. I didn't want to make my video 40 minutes long. Appreciate the sub, friend. Not that deep. I'm just going to give my perspective on a few things that he said in his video. So, the first thing I want to talk about is the freaking title. This man's title said, let me pull it up. His title was, Mine and Paris, the failed internet love story. Address it all. Hope out now. That title was so OD. Hope is out now, by the way. It definitely is. If you're watching this, you feel me? I know some of you are watching this. If you don't like me, <laughs> all right. If you love me, go bump the music, you know? Yeah. Well, <laughs> it was so like. Even to the people that don't like you, nigga. First of all, where did the failed internet love story came? Like, where did that come from? Where where did the love story come from? I'm confused. I was so confused about the title. I was like, now this is this is doing too much. And I even texted him and I told him, I said, this is doing way too much. Like, what do you mean? And he was like, um, your title was doing too much. And I was like, no, my title was me 
and my beef and question mark because that's what someone sent me like people are asking me are we beef because we ain't putting out content simple as that we're not in a relationship it's like if, if we like but yeah title od i didn't like the title or whatever but that's that yeah, that's what he should have just said it's a fucking title <laughs> It was going to get views. People need to start using views. <laughs> Y'all, I, I never used to say anything about views, clout, content, like, because people are very sensitive. But when I realized that this is my fucking job and I do not go to your job and tell you how to work, that changed my whole perspective. I put the title out there like that because it would get views. Simple and plain. Okay. What are we talking about? <laughs> um, another thing that I wanted to talk about was the prank video. Um, a lot of people had a lot of like questions about was it real, like, or was it a prank? And okay, so before I did the video, you know, Grigio, as he mentioned in, the, in his video, that I did reach out to him because I was like, I said, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I want to do a prank on you. I said, I'm gonna prank you. Um, texting you. Um, I said, I'm a prank you, texting you. He got patience. That I got feelings for you. Blah, blah, blah. Find out what's strong hold with on, you. Hold on, hold on, don't. We ain't getting, we ain't getting taken over by no ads. More. Let's get it right. Let's get hey, it get right. Get it tight. Get it right. Get it right. Get it tight. Let's get back in it. Come. They'll help you design something. Uh, shut up, Ashley. Oh. And that's what I told him. For him to, now, for him to say on camera that I texted him and I did that. Like, that's just crazy because it's like, as a content creator, like, I've never heard nobody physically say on YouTube that a prank was playing. And, like, the other person knew about the prank. We had the conversation, yeah, but I never seen nobody on. I didn't even know that's what, I didn't even know, like, that's how pranks were, you know, made. And he was like, um, yeah, so whenever you, blah, 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 like, whenever you want to do, like, a prank or something or anything, like, just let me know, like, like, it's supposed to be known, like, on both sides, so, like, the person won't feel a certain way. I don't First of all, the prank that she did wouldn't have even work. I don't text back nobody in a timely manner. So, that prank and that video of her sitting in front of that camera that she did, if it was perfectly scaled and it would have been... Ha 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 how she wanted it to be. It would have took her two hours to do it. No, some facts. <laughs> Listen, pranks are for entertainment. Okay, some people have to tell each other about a prank so somebody don't get killed. Some people have to tell each other about the prank so your ass can text back or be by your phone when I text you. Some people have to tell you about the prank. So 911 don't get called. Some people have to tell you about the prank because all pranks cannot be real. I'm sorry if that just really hurt some of y'all feelings. Sorry, honestly, not sorry. Because this shit is for entertainment. I do not go up to Jamie Foxx and be like, bro, why you acting? <laughs> why, why do you do that? That nigga would say, so I can get views. <laughs> he needs to get views. He needs to have box office sales he needs to get his multi-million dollar deal off of his acting i don't see y'all asking jamie fox i don't see y'all approaching uh regina howard i don't see y'all going up to uh uh jordan jordan what's that nigga name jordan b whatever okay michael b jordan him i don't see y'all approaching none of these folks but everybody come to the youtubers why you faking pranks? Why you da da da? Why you da da da? Like, damn. <laughs> Whoever said in the prank rule book, slide down the scroll, this is supposed to be real. I, I just, where is that in the rule book? I need to know. Some Honestly. shit. Some shit. And I respected his, you know, uh, I respected that. Like, I respected the fact that he wanted me to come to him first, which is cool because it's like, if you prank me, shit. I mean, I don't mind you just off the rip just pranking me because I like. Rock. Okay, that's because we know they are actors. They're not trying to portray it as a real thing. Well, y'all better learn to put two and two together or get these context clues together. Because if you still cannot take it as entertainment, 
then something is wrong with you. <laughs> I mean, period. <laughs> like, I don't know what to tell you. And actually, they do portray things to be real and act as if they are real. Like guns, like killing someone, like um, drowning with a fucking uh, 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 alligator. I don't know. The shit that they put in these movies, they portray it to be real, actually. So... Yeah, this is just, this is some shit I just would never, like, yeah, y'all either gonna get it or you not. I really don't care. Actions, <laughs> but, you know, that's what he wanted, and that's what he suggested. Quit so drinking wine out the bottle with your crazy ass. So. Now I almost took a tooth out. said, <laughs> was my feelings real in the video? Like I said, like, it was a prank. <laughs> it was a freaking Stop prank. Stop the cat. How in the freak <laughs> can I form feelings? I don't know. I don't know if. People do that, but I don't form feelings. Stop the cat. I don't, have, I don't form feelings. This is like, this is, I, good look. Stop the cat. Shorty called me the night after the video to tell me that it wasn't a prank. That she dead felt how she felt. Don't do that now. Just because they don't know everything. Don't do that. Stop the cat. And I, I came on here and snitched I, on her again. I feel like this is a bad idea. Feelings with people that I have just I don't care met anymore. and only did Word. YouTube videos with. And Stop caring. He, he kept saying like it was like anymore. a work relationship, and that is true. Like it was like work. And I said in the beginning of that video, I said I'm, I'm trying to spice it up. I'm trying to you know create some good content. I thought that's what we was doing in the first place. Then why did you call me after the video and tell me that you really wanted to <sighs> stop the cat? I thought like, that's what we was doing. So. Mm. Um, yeah, so with that video, it was a prank. Those feelings were not real. It was literally me just getting his reactions. Stop the cap. She called me at like 11 o'clock that same night after the video was already done to be like, she sitting in the car like, nah, I really had that. I re like, I really, uh, you know, doing that girl thing that girls do when they like a nigga. Stop. See, if how he would react if I told him I had feelings for him. Great content, right? Maybe I was, you know, maybe I did take it, you know, too far saying um, it got real. Maybe that was taking it too far, but shit, that is, to me, I was just, you know, giving y'all content. It is what it is. You know, maybe I shouldn't have did it that way. Who knows? It happened or whatever, but the con that prank was not, you know, those feelings were not real. Mm. And he knows that because I, when I hit him up, I said, I'm going to prank you. I'm about to do it. Earlier in the day. When I, when we did what you what you left out was the conversation when you called me later that night. That's what you're leaving out the video. I mean, if we gonna be real, just be real. You feel me? <laughs> she responded I, to this. They, everybody complained about my 42 minutes, but I was, I was, I feel like I was honest. I was he was honest. though. Pranks, pranks aren't like. That's the best 42 minutes I ever watched with him. I ain't gonna hold you. <laughs> and, and YouTube are, history. From my understanding, pranks are not like it's just it's it's a prank like you. You do something and it's just not, not real. even looking at the camera. Like it's, just, like, it's a prank, like it's a joke. <laughs> That's how I looked at it. I feel like it was a joke. I didn't say nothing at first because it's just like some stuff you just don't really have Girl, to she like, just lying. Know, address. <laughs> like if somebody feel like my feelings are real, should they feel like that? If they didn't feel like it was real, if it was all jokes, they feel like that. I ain't that it wasn't I just didn't feel the need to address that part in the beginning. But I'm addressing it now that she was fake, like it wasn't that serious and wasn't deep. And for him to say, like, um, he kind of he was just like, oh, like, damn, like she really catching feelings. No, <laughs> no, baby, you from when I if I if, when me catching feelings with anybody, baby, I like to be wine and dine. I like hell of attention. You gotta um, show me that you are interested in me before I show you that I'm interested in you. Girl, she looking around because she lying, y'all. <laughs> Respectfully. Like, I mean, it's, it could be mutual, but at the end of the day, like, I'm a woman and I feel like if I'm gonna put I can't, myself out I can't, Mo. I can't, Mo. We already discussed that, we discussed that before yeah. uh, we, I even uploaded it or even did the prank, so. Yeah, and I even told him, like, he should do it on me, too. I told him, I'm like, use one of your songs. <laughs> Not once he mentioned the phone call. I was like, goddamn, Sagittarius, just be lying. And <laughs> do, like, a lyric prank on me. I don't know why she didn't think he was going to respond and tell the truth. Yes, she did tell me to do that. And I was going to do Happy Place on her. But the reason why I did not do the Happy Place prank on her is because 
I knew what that would entail. When she did the prank, she called me that night again in case anybody, like, I really, like, this is crazy. She called me that night and was telling me, like, nah, like, you know, I really, uh, 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 I'm not going to expose everything. Uh, 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 she really want to, uh, 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 and I'm like, all right. So I'm like, if I do this Happy Place prank on it, the Happy Place song is beautifully written. No, right. nobody have to help a Sagittarius lie. They do it on them, by themselves. Literally. <laughs> they do it on their own. <laughs> okay. And Mod the God, <laughs> one of the best rappers ever to do this damn thing with the words. The way I wrote that song is like, if those words would have been put in a text message form, everybody would have took this way too serious, which is why I completely stayed away from that. I thought, no. Every time, every time I got to the close to it, I was like, nah, if the if I would have wrote the song a little different, it probably would have been worth it. But it was like the way the song is written, it's like my real. It's like her making these vids, right mentioning now, my is another way up, so she's using it. to make money. Yeah. Texting me like a lyric, like, like I feel like I, I was on a, I was on a, the time like making content, you know, getting y'all, you know, entertained. Like I'm trying to be entertaining. Stop the gap. I was trying to put on the show a little bit, you know what I'm saying. But maybe it did backfire on me. Ma, but did you drink you know, anything? Shot a bit, you know what I'm saying? But oh, it maybe it did backfire on me. Doing <laughs> be that. licking the shot, don't. I don't know. Like I really don't licking care the wine. that much. But I'm only addressing it, like I said, because I want you know it's good for content and why not? All right. So the next thing that I want to talk like about six minutes on that topic is Seven. him bringing up that I'm a ten stripper. minutes actually. I don't care if you are. Sam. What if every time Let's someone's... Let's get paid. Let's not do that. Let's make sure we get paid. Let's make sure we get paid. Make, make sure we get paid. Stick that at. I'll be right back. In your intentions are good. Or if your intentions are bad. You bring up that I'm a stripper. It has nothing to do with none of this. I want to hear it what you got to say to about this. With, you got like eight stripper nothing, logs. Because in the beginning, before you even... Before we even made a video, before we even decided to link up, you knew that I was a stripper. Or that, that stripper was my um, job. Like, that's what I do. Like, that's my job. And I just felt like that I, coming, like, any, like, saying anything that's a fact. I about do that. being a stripper or ha making that, you know, or making that have something to do with you not responding to me. I never like, said, I mean, never said, no, the commenters are saying... The stripper thing is why I didn't respond to you. I said I respectfully tried to leave that out of the content. He did. Like I don't. I, again, again, I don't remember saying that. You knew but that I was if I did, from the beginning, so I was. So he did. About that, I don't. I, was like, I don't have anything against doing content with strippers, and I don't have anything against strippers. Yo, I feel like my fan base again. It's 85. If you check my YouTube, let me see if I can check. Let me see if I can pull it up. I hope I can do it quick. Let me see if I can pull up my YouTube di di graph, uh, demographics. Who's Did anyone audience? else feel like can I pull up my demographics? Up this Look at my demographics right here, y'all. No. I'm not gonna cut. I'm not gonna show y'all any that much. Look at my demographics right here. 75. Nigga. 75.9% of the people that watch me on YouTube are women. 24.1% of the people that watch me on YouTube are men. Mine is 95% women. Sometimes the things I say may not come off as sensitive to a woman. I apologize if I offended you, Paris, or anybody, you feel me? But to be honest, I would get like I would I would get DMs from people to like take it farther and like, yo, like bro, do this, do this, and I'd be like, you know, I'm not just gonna disrespect her. I'm I'm I didn't and and and, and again, like she said, she said her intentions when she was on live wasn't that. When I brought that up in the video. I literally brought that up in the video to say like I didn't want to treat her like that. I literally said in the video, Miss Chi, I will say that um, Clarence got a huge part in being petty with this, but I don't think 
Are you saying that's what brought her to do this reaction? I'm trying to follow where you're going with this. So just because Love she y'all too. what she does uh, doesn't mean that's queen. what she wants to be known by. I thought I said that. If if that wasn't clear, I apologize. But like, I knew this was going to happen at some point. That somebody was just going to like use me being a stripper to make up anything because first of all baby i know who i am as a person i am the most genuine nice person ever no sagittarius are the most manipulative uh sign that i've ever encountered okay they come off as just like she said that's not my character to come off like i'm using anybody blah 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 sis y'all was using each other what she should have said was this is the whole point to entertain and make money, is it not? I mean, that would be the honesty. So I was, you know, I came on here to make money and give content. She made it seem like, nah, I don't have, I didn't have any ill intentions with trying to do blah, blah, blah. But your intentions was to just make money. Get with this nigga, make money and go about your business. That was the intention. She fumbled the bag as well, trying to act like she was telling the nigga she in love with him and like him a lot and whatever she told him. But in all actuality, that was not it. She ain't really like him like that, I feel like. But she tried to tell him that because she thought she could swindle her way in. She thought she could run game on the nigga and it would not work. <laughs> so it scared him enough to be like, oh, hell no, I don't even want to respond. It, it's almost like she told him she loved him. You know men ain't going for that shit. Not a man that don't want you. You he he clearly did not want her. You know what I'm saying? So her trying to run game on him is it, it just she failed. You know what I'm saying? So all of this wasn't genuine. That wasn't genuine. This isn't a I, I was trying to be not that's not what this was. You wanted a bag. <laughs> Like it's just, it's time to be honest these days, boy. I know, like I say, it's some shit that I would have to reiterate. Because at one point in time, it's almost like you couldn't be honest on YouTube. And that's why my saying, like, I don't give a fuck no more. And I don't either. Okay? Because at the end of the day, bro, we got shit to do. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? This is work. Every time I get on YouTube, react to Ma, react to Clarence, react to Queen, react to Chris. Like, that is what y'all ask me to react to. So no matter if somebody, you sucking them, you, I don't give a damn about none of that shit. That's what y'all want me to watch? Let's get to it. You know what I'm saying? That's it. This shit is work, okay? Like, like, Period. literally, my intentions are so pure. I do everything with love, and I do everything with pure intentions. Line. With, That's the Sagittarius like, shit. stripper ain't got nothing to do with nothing. And it's just period. So. Pipe down on the stripper comments because, baby. I never treated you like one. And she took the stripper uh, took context. I, took I mean, girl. took the stripper comment all the way out of context. Like, I, I have to say that I literally watched him speak about the stripper shit. And he said that he did not want to discuss the stripper shit because he didn't want her to feel like he was just trying to, you know, do certain type of content because she was a stripper. I mean, he made that very clear, but... That's a good spot. I never treated you like you were a stripper. He did. I never treated you like I wanted to hit it. I never treated you like... I never treated... I, I, I was always respectful. I have to say he did. <laughs> Not on the camera. The first video we did on your channel ever, when I first met you, you displayed your stripper outfits to me. Everybody knew you was a stripper. I don't even get how... We're, we're using that as like me, to make me look like I was bullying you in some way. I would come, like just like she said. Anybody that knows me knows I'm the nicest person in the world, and I I got good intentions, and I move with a pure heart. So I'll be done with this shit. I guess we y'all ain't gonna hear nothing to say. So period. Don't don't mention nothing about me being a stripper no more because it ain't got nothing to do with nothing. It ain't got nothing to do with my character. It ain't got nothing to do with my personality. Like. If you're going to be a stripper, sis, you got to stand on that. Because she really making that sound. Like, she really got sensitive about the stripper comment. And, I, I you know, he we all sat there and watched him. <laughs> and he literally wasn't saying anything disrespectful about her being a stripper at all. Like I said, she might have been talking to the people in the comments. But she got to keep it with the people in the comments. He didn't disrespect her about that stripper shit. I'm not going to lie. He didn't. Bless you. Stop doing videos. Bless you. You've 
done three or four different things that you've mentioned yourself that you're a stripper. You have stripper law in your title. I just I just don't even get how that is being made offensive. But again, I have a woman fan base that's sensitive and I'm sorry, y'all. It ain't got nothing to do with my, my morals, my values, and how I live, and none of that. That's just my job, and that's what I do. And they got nothing to do with nothing, okay? I'd have been in relationships. I'd have had a relationship, a long-term relationship, while I was there. So, like, I am, that's just like, crazy. it ain't got nothing to do with nothing at the end of the day. It's okay. a Sagittarius to take something you say the total wrong way. Like, okay. Give a fuck. What type of comment he had, don't say nothing about me being a stripper, because they ain't got nothing to do with nothing. I'm going to keep saying it. <laughs> So the comment that I made when I was like, um, he ain't taking me on a date chat, I was responding to like one of my supporters under my post and I guess he saw that. Of course he did, just like he took me on a date, which was like No, it's more than it's more than the comments under the supporters. You said that on Twitch, on live, in front of the people. But I digress. I just feel like with this whole thing I Honestly, I'm a I'ma say this. And I ain't trying to point fingers, because I take, I'm, I hold, you know, I take responsibility for whatever I did. You know, if it offended anybody or whatever. But Clarence is the one that hyped Yo, all this shit up. Yo, nah, Clarence. I'm just he saying. did. Yo, he the one that hyped Clarence. it up. He the one. Nah, he did. Nah, ma, he did. <laughs> Sorry, he did. You know he did. He did. <laughs> they said, um, I he, he might... Mom may feel that way because he felt like Clarence was joking, which Clarence probably was joking. But the thing is, it didn't look like that to the supporters. You know what I'm saying? He was just, Clarence was gassing it for entertainment, I'm sure. However, he just was saying it to the wrong people. Clarence. <laughs> Girl, all this, you know, joint, whatever they be saying. He the one that said that. <laughs> and he was saying it, like, he was just hyping it up. Oh, <laughs> he nah. is upset about that. He no, oh no, it's no copyright be right now. Please, please, please don't do me like that. Not Clarence, Ooh, smoke. It, Cause it, I, I didn't think that it would be, it it would like get to this because it wasn't that serious. Like it was just us doing videos. Yeah, he was trying to get into the bag. I agree with that, Miss G. Period. That be his dream for my. Uh, appreciate. Um, Ma and Clarence for like really like you know giving me the subscribers that I had and giving me the 10k and all of this. But did bring Queen into it. Okay. Clarence is the one that hyped it up and did the most. And and, and she thanked Clarence with me. Crazy. <laughs> it was. You know, Shout out to my boy. It was that. But um, that comment when I said that he didn't take me on a date trip wasn't necessarily me. Saying that I want him to take me on a date. It would have been good for content. I mean, and then, let me say this, since we want to talk about, you know, stuff that really don't, doesn't matter. But, shit, he reached out to me, asking me if I wanted to do um a blind date. Him, him, me, and Clarence would be doing a blind date. So, it's like, how is it, how is this all, like, a thing? Okay. When... The content was gonna be. Who reached out to you? No, 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 no. Put out. No, no, anyway. no, no, no. You gotta nobody, pause it. No, nobody reached Ma, out. Ma, you gotta pop. I was just so confused. Not I be trying to help my new reactor friends, although he's not a new reactor. He acting like it. Nobody <laughs> reached out. Pretty many long. Oh, he. Nobody reached out. I mean, I didn't even get a phone. Wait, maybe he trying to think. His thinking uh, ass. That's cat. Nobody reached out to me. Okay. Him. So I'm just. I was just a little bit confused. I'm like, I even texted him. I was like, bro, what is this? <laughs> What is this? And we text a little bit. He he got his point across a little bit, and I got my point across. And he reached out. He didn't say nothing else, which I'm trying to figure out. I'm going to just say, like, he just bad with communication, or maybe he just don't care. Like, I really, I don't care both. that much to it's care that much. But I'm just saying, you like, care. when it comes to, she like. cares so much, though. It's like, what else? It's like, at this point, what am I, what? I'm not bad with communication. When it gets to a point where it's like, we just gonna have to agree to disagree i'm not about to sit here and, and argue like i'm not the thing is he didn't have to argue on the bad with communication part he could have just told her like my nigga listen i ain't i don't like you i feel like you trying to do blah 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 would be good communication however he just he chose violence and to not communicate that <laughs> now 
you know, some people may think he's right and some people may think he's wrong. But at the end of the day, I it's giving both for me. <laughs> it's giving both for me because he could have told her, you know. But he decided not to, so it is what it is. I don't know if that would make him bad at communication, bad or good. I just think he just chose not to say nothing. And I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> like, it really, it, it really doesn't matter. He didn't have to, like, though. He didn't. Like, come on. He like, did. it really doesn't matter. Like, if that's the case, uh, like, it then didn't matter. Like, come Making on. Making content, on, I feel like, and I'm, putting yourself I'm, out there, I'm, especially I'm, like, I'm with another person, so like, other ways. it should be like a mutual, a mutual understanding between the two people that's working together. If we are work friends, you feel what I'm saying? So, listen, I'm trying to make this a scenario. This is a scenario. Give me something. I used to work at Key Bank, right? I don't know what that is. My boy that used to sit right next to me, Pat, when I used to work at Key Bank, I worked at Key Bank for like a year and a half. Pat. When I was working at Key Bank, there was a point where I literally was homeless living with a joint because that was just, that was just where my life was at in Buffalo at a point, right? Right. Pat never knew that. Pat just knew I was trying to get on as a rapper. You feel me? Pat was my work friend. We talked about work. Right. Pat knew, like, how to help me look at bank accounts. Right. Like, why am I expressing to Pat? Oh. At least talk to me. Tell me, like, if you were going through something, it ain't nothing to pick up a phone. You was posting on Instagram, you know what I'm saying? Like, so <laughs> I just feel like him ignoring me, ghosting me, was just uncalled for. Like, that's what I said. Like, I said it's uncalled for. Like, all you did was hit me up one time. Title? One text Man. would have solved all of this. Literally. Literally. Then, but then when you did hit me up again, I text you back. I said, I'm going through a lot. You know, how are you? You told me how you is. I ain't feel like we had nothing else to talk about. Like I'm just, I'm, I'm just short. I, I'm, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe you know. Maybe I'm just a different type of nigga. No, you just a nigga. You know, <laughs> that's it. You know, he, he's just a nigga who, who really did not care about this girl. He did not want her in no way. He felt like she was trying to play his ass, and he was dodging a bullet before he got shot. That's what I got. I don't know what y'all got, but that's exactly all that I have, actually. The that's all I have. A lot of people I really, wrong, so. um, just picked a few like things out of his wrong, video wrong. to talk about. The last thing I want to talk about is um, he said that um, when I did my Q&A and I answered a question about collabing with him, um, him, Queen, and Clarence, I had, I had answered a question and he was like, I'm not new. I'm, I'm like, I'm new to um, this lifestyle, some shit he said, basically saying like, they're not about to give you no clout. Like, That's what, he what he say? Said. Oh my god, I forgot that. what he said. But he said something on the the lines of. I actually specifically remember. I said that would be a question that normally wouldn't have been in your question and answer box, so I could get how you would answer it because it would bring a bit more attention. It's a, like it's a question about me, Queen and Clarence, and a blind date. Of course, that question on your. I, I, niggas gonna say I'm wrong, Mo. Basically, Stop. I'm not used to this, and me answering that co that question wasn't necessary or some shit. Don't quote me on what he said, but I, I feel some type of way. There's too many feelings and emotions from her and in, in general for them to not have even been smashing. Girl, she didn't even get the D. I, I I don't I don't understand why this is so serious. I'm not even gonna lie. Way because this first is of all, stupid. <laughs> I'm not even going to lie. First of all, I am mature enough. I am wise enough to, and I and I have self-control. Like, me meeting, like, I meet celebrities all the fucking time. <laughs> like, so whether I was going to collab with Queen and Clarence, how was that me not being used to, like, this lifestyle? Because, first of all, before YouTube, baby. I never said you weren't new to the lifestyle. You got 60K, you had 60K on the gram before you met me, so you clearly have some kind of like popularity out here. You know, I'm not taking that from you at all. What I did say is you were used to a certain amount of attention on 
specific. No, the they didn't. I don't think they smashed at all. And yes, that answering that it probably be worse would bring if they your did. question the answer more attention. Am I wrong? People his first time meet, his first time meeting her was that video that they did on her channel, I believe. Then they said the second time they chill was when she came to his house when they went live. They only chill for a, a, like a few times, but neither one of them talking about smashing. I mean, maybe they didn't just not talking about it, but if they did, that would explain this. But I really don't think that they did anything. I know. Oh, she said they didn't. Yeah, I don't think they I did. I don't follow them. I don't be on a dick. I don't be. I don't do none of that. I so honestly don't think he was even like attracted to her. Like, and she's a beautiful woman. I'm not taking that away from her. Don't come for me. But I'm just saying, I I really don't think he was attracted to her. Something is not right. Okay. Say that mm -hmm. me answering their question wasn't cause for like I, I'm not used to this lifestyle and I'm just being never hyped said up lifestyle. Never said that. Never said that. I never said that. If I said that more, I might like be. I said, oh, I she's celibate. Of course, I would love to collab with Queen. Then maybe that's what it was. He probably ain't even want that involvement because he wouldn't get no ass no way. I don't know. Oh. And do a video with Queen. I love Queen. Like, Queen, I love her. Okay. I don't even want to be an asshole because I feel like saying this is going to make me a little bit of an asshole. But Paris told me out her mouth that if she ever met Queen, she wouldn't know how to act. Like, she told me that. She was like, yo, I love Queen so much that if I met Queen, it might be a little crazy because I wouldn't know how to act at first. Like, I really wouldn't. Like, I love her so much. Like, a lot of people feel that way. I didn't hold that against her, but just don't. A lot of people don't feel that way. Respectfully, regular people don't. When I met Queen... It was almost like, hey, bitch, like, you know, what's up, bitch? Like, you know what I'm saying? What's good with you? What's popping? What y'all got going on or whatever? That will forever be me. Zoe, Clarence, Damo, everybody. Whoever I met, what, bitch? Hey, what's going on with you? It is never, and anybody that say it is is a goddamn lie. But it'll never be a point to where I'm shaking in my boots for meeting anybody. Because that I am me and you are you. You might have a couple more coins, bitch, but we bleed the same. I, I don't, I would have never took her around, queen. I hate fan bitches. I hate it. I hate fan bitches, okay? And that's a fan. Like you, that's why I tell y'all. If you come to me talking about I've been a fan of you and, you know, I don't feel right since you did, blah, blah, blah. I was a fan of you. And no, if you know me, I don't have fans. Okay, I don't, I don't have fans. That's not what I do. I got a league. We fuck with each other. We like second cousins and shit. You know what I'm saying? I don't do fans. <laughs> and you... Just fan the fuck out. I wouldn't have never introduced the neither. Never. Don't come up never. here and do this now. Like, <laughs> Hell like, no. Stop the cap. It's like stop the cap. She music. She dope as fuck. She genuine. She's as amazing. Fuck. I can tell. I wouldn't have never did that. So I don't even think. I don't even think it's a problem for you to feel that way. That. But it's like I'm just. It is a problem. I ain't gonna say it's a problem like that. <laughs> but I'm a. It's a problem for me if I'm if I fuck with you. And I have to question myself if I need to bring you around my celebrity friend. I'm sure a lot of people have people that are, you know, people that just, they normal, they do what they do. And they bring them around celebrities and girl, they act like they're not even in a room. Oh, hey, how you doing? Girl, let's take this picture. Like, <laughs> me. Oh, hey, how you doing? Hey, one second. I need to take this picture real fast. I got you. Give me a second, bitch. Let's take this picture, bitch. We like these. I am, I'm just, I don't do the fan out. I don't, I don't. And if anybody was around me that fanned out, I, you, I probably, I'm honestly not around them anymore <laughs> because, you know, it was a lot of people. I had to question like, should I put you in the room with her? Because I don't know if you're going to fan out. You know what I'm saying? Worst shit ever. And if you, if you fan out, yeah, I, you can't come with me. Um, Call me crazy, nigga, but you can't. Yeah. Whatever. So I just feel like if I was to collab collaborate, and she even said it on the like, I, it wasn't even my idea. <laughs> it was Queen's idea to 
do a double date and collab. So it just it's just crazy to me how he bringing up all of this when it has nothing to do with him not responding. You could have been mature enough to just he like you know even respond to one message. You didn't even have to pick up the phone. You could have respond. It's you could have responded to one message I sent before all this happened. Before I got on live, you could have responded to one message. And we would have been and just said like I'm going through something right now. Maybe we can create content a little bit later or express what you expressed in that video. November seventh. Oh, I'm like what? From Paris. Are you okay? I hope you are. November 7th, from mine. Yeah, I'm good. I've been having a lot going on. I had to sit down and figure shit out for real. <laughs> How are you? Paris, nah, I feel you. And I've been good. I guess that wasn't good enough, Mo. I guess that just wasn't good to enough. To me. Mo. Oh, like a Sagittarius, she don't give a damn about the fact that he was going through some shit. And that's, honestly, I think that turned him off more than anything else. Because it would with me. Don't let me tell you I'm going through some shit and you act as if, like, you give zero fucks that I'm... She didn't even say, like, you need anything? You need any help with what you got going on? You, you're you right? Nah, when you don't do that for me, also why I cut people off. Y'all, I'm so quick to cut niggas off because they show their hand. No matter how y'all look at them, I don't give a fuck. I'm really behind the scenes with these fuck niggas. They show their hand. They show that motherfucker, bro. Like, yo, man, I'm fucked up right now. I don't, I, I'm not good, nigga. Oh, well, all right, oh, shit. I'm good. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, my, okay. Well, I thank you for showing me your hand, please. I am very understanding. I know how to take, um... Um, I, I mean, I'm good with rejection. Like, I don't care. Like, no, you're I not. Rejection? It wasn't even he, rejection. So like, it wasn't even rejection. If he would have just hit me up and I, she, like, <laughs> I feel like this is too much, blah, blah, blah. Like, I ain't mean to get this far. I ain't mean to go like this. Boom. Understood. Understood. On to the next. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not the type of person to, like, Oh, hell no. I'm not the type of person to, like, you know, make things worse than what it is. That's why it took me a little minute to even make this video because I'm like, should I even do it or not? Like, but like I said, it's different content, so I'm doing it. But anyways, yeah, like, I just feel like that. Like, the bag. Me, me too. It's good for content. My message, the bag. The exactly. Place. That's the truth that we actually got here. <laughs> they both doing it for the bag. So am I. You know what I'm saying? Let's, let's just be honest these days. We got bills. Like I said, there's no no, I don't really care that much to like have a problem with nobody on YouTube because this is my. I'm trying to make this my yeah 13 you know, lifestyle. So me beefing with anybody that got something to do with YouTube, that's not my goal. So and being mad at people like that's not my goal because at the end of the day we're doing the same thing. Like even I'm like this even at the club, even when I'm at work, it, it's like girls. Be wanna like, you know, be for me enough. You see, she brought the club up again. I'm not on that. I'm not my literally that she don't even She brought it up my, again. Herself that really don't even enter my my mind. Like that's they don't have like I vibrate so high. Mm. What's smacking on that so damn high. shit to me? Like anything negative does not entertain me like that like i try to stay away from anything negative i literally try my best to stay away from anything negative i can't really control everything but i can control my environment and i am going to do that i'm going to control my peace i'm going to control my frequency i am going to vibrate high and continue to vibrate high and stay positive that's how i am and that's how i'm ready that's what i think that's what my mind is Am I not a high vibrate nigga? I feel like I don't take that out on yourself, my boy. At a high level, nigga. Like I feel like I vibrate clear. Like my vibration level is very high. That's all I'm gonna say, man. What else does she have to say? Like, and that is like nothing. But that is that's it for this video, y'all. 
I like wasn't I low vibrate at all. So, so I low vibrate. I vibrate on low. Not he took that like she was saying that you know what? <laughs> it's too many emotions there for me. Yo, honestly, I got no beef with Paris. I got no beef with Paris. You feel me? Is there some cap in this video? It's a little cap. Other than that, man, let me go. Let me go end my reaction. It is your boy Mod. <laughs> it is Vlogmas. There will be mad videos coming this month. Your boy's working dumb far. Hope out now. You feel me? If you don't like me, you don't like me. <laughs> and that's okay. You know, that's okay. And if you love me, I love you too. If you my boys, if you one of my niggas and you holding it down, boom. And I see a lot of people out here saying, I'm not attractive. You know, I never been with the, with the, with the good joints. You know, again, you feel me? Come see how I'm really living on this side, you feel me? Other than that, it's your biggity. I'm going to holla at you. Enjoy your day. Bow. Yo, I was just thinking, he listened to it. In my comments, y'all was trying it, trying to call him the G word. And I'm just like, y'all, this nigga is not that. I never thought he was that. But, um, I yeah, I don't have nothing else to say. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Yeah, yeah.